Tracy from Portland, have you ever seen someone from stage and thought, wow, I know that person? If you do, do you say hi or wink? Um, it's more of a head nod. If you're asking if I've ever seen someone on stage that I know, yes, I have. Not on stage. I'm on stage, but they're in the crowd. It's more of like a like, like we make, you know, we get the eye contact and it's kind of like, it's like a sub kind of thing, you know. They get it. They know what I'm talking about. If I've ever done it, you know what I'm talking about. Jennifer from Bismarck, North Dakota. Is that right? Bismarck, North Dakota. That's right. How many tattoos do you have? Do you have a wish list of tats that you want? I have zero tattoos, and I do not have a wish list as of this moment. My mother is over here somewhere telling me to not get any tattoos, by the way, which I probably will get now because she was doing that. Not really. I'm not really going to do that. Stacy from Nashville, can you give us an example of how you warm up your voice to sing? Man, I, I just can't do that. It's, I just can't. I just can't do that. <laughs> yeah, that's it. That's how I, that's how I do it. Right. Yeah, that's it. That's it. That's it. Right there. <laughs> We, we have a, um, are you aware of the iPhone ringtones? I'm asking the, I'm asking the room and also the camera. You know the iPhone ringtones? So we were in, we had a flight get delayed one time and we decided that it would be fun to record our own iPhone ringtone, but it's the same. So we're just like, you should see people when it goes off. Man. It's, it's very interesting. It's very interesting. Isabella from Oakland, what up? Uh, if you were a rapper, what would your gangster name be? <laughs> oh, jeez. Um, uh, big Cheeseburger or something? I don't, I don't, <laughs> I don't know. I, Lil Cheeseburger, probably. Or some big, probably Big Pizza or so, something with food and big probably would, would be the combo. Pick your favorite food and the word big, and that would be the <laughs> Kylie from Flint. Go ahead. <laughs> Go ahead, Chris. I was like, what is he talking about? He's like, then he has to do it. Anyways, sorry, Kylie. Kylie from Flint. I bought a copy of your CD for all of my sisters. Well, thank you. I think the last thing I could ask is could you say hi to them? Brianna and Caitlin, hello. This is Luke Combs. Your sister Kylie asked me to say hello, so I'm saying hello. Thank you. What else we got? Grace from Fort Myers. Been there. How much stuff do you lose when you're out on tour? Have you ever come home and found something in your suitcase that made you say, how did that get there? <laughs> no, I have not done that, fortunately. Um, I don't know how much stuff I lose besides, like, food and stuff, which we eat. But socks, maybe. My mom says I lose a lot of socks on the road. Um, my mom's not on the road very much, but mother's instinct, she knows. A couple left, a couple left. Jeannie from Memphis, what is your favorite piece of Luke Combs merch? Hmm. Um, all of it. It's all wonderful, available at the merch booth, at your discretion. I'll even give you a discount if you tell them I sent you. So, last question. Kara from Noblesville. Not that you could put it on this one's for you, but do you have a favorite rock or top 40 song that you secretly sing around the house that you would want to record? That's a good question. Um, does it have to be new? I wish you were here. Does it have to be a new song? Probably not, I'm guessing. Um, I don't know. I'm a big John Legend fan. I sing a lot of that stuff around the house, so maybe so a John Legend song would be, would be cool, I guess. Special thanks goes out to Cody Allen and CMT for making this happen today. My new CD is called This One's For You. Thanks again to the fans for all the great questions. I'll see you on the road soon. What do they say when they do that?